Well, it would seem that the Ishmaelite Muslim migrants have some far leftist allies who are trying to imitate their barbaric wild man Ishmaelite type behavior. Okay, this is over in France because France is just a hotbed for this all all kinds of just weird insanity from the Ishmaelite, you know, barbaric Ishmaelite Muslim migrants and also seems to be more uh, increasingly their far leftist allies. This is over in France, you know, of course, why not? This is on Bare Naked Islam. It says, far left bleeding heart activists break into the private home of elderly couple and claim it as shelter for illegal alien invaders posing as asylum seekers. Members of the People's House organization illegally re 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 sorry, re not good at reading on a computer, uh, re their proper the property near to the Grand Blotero, sorry, Grand Blotero Park in the western city of Nantes, claiming that it had been left with they had that they had been left with no other option after authorities failed to respond to their concerns about the shortage of temporary housing available to asylum seekers. Huh. So they're just gonna take any kind of house they want, uh, just essentially rob and invade and you know t uh, kick out the actual owners of the home because again this is the kind of behavior you would expect from the Ishmaelite Muslim you know the barbaric Ishmaelite Muslim migrants but also this is the kind of behavior we should expect from their allies their left-wing socially liberal allies says uh, Remax News. In a statement posted on the organization's Twitter account, the People's House claimed to have waited for weeks without response from authorities about their concerns for the well-being of new arrivals to the area. Urgency is facing us. We could have seen so many people die on the streets. What should we do? The statement read. And then, you know, the commentary is taken to, the, to your own homes. Yeah, good point. The organization accused the state of choosing to spend uh, exor exorbitant uh, sums on private security firms and anti-squat devices rather than provide a place to sh of shelter to the increasingly increasing number of asylum seekers and economic migrants to the city. It also claimed that direct action taken on Saturday was not a choice but a necessity. It is the only way for us to act and provide an answer to these families abandoned by the authorities. They were not they were not abandoned, they were illegal aliens, as the commentary says. It is for this reason and for their lack, lack of other choices that despite our reluctance, we now occupy a private house which was empty when they broke in. They admit they broke in and stole the place. Wow. The mentality, the, just the nerve on these people. Uh, they added, it was empty because the owners were in a care facility at the time. Following the illegal uh, re re sorry, reacquisition, reacquisition, sorry, of the property, two Syrian families and a Congolese family with three with three children have since moved into the elderly couple's home. Speaking to well, on well, France, however you say it, again, not good at reading on a computer, news outlet, the grandson of the home, homeowners expressed his dismay, dismay and anger at the action taken and revealed that he had filed a complaint with the authorities. He called the move an unacceptable illegal situation and questioned whether the rule of law still applies in France. Uh, should we be able to execute justice ourselves? He said, or he asked, claiming that the inaction of the public authorities and illegal takeovers by militant associations could lead to real tragedies. Well, I mean, if they did that to my home, I would just, you know, I would take matters into my own hands. If the authorities are doing nothing, well, they can't just leech off your home like that, you know? And, oh, oh, they're in a care facility, so we're just going to take their home. Hey, it's still their home. You can't just break into someone's home and take it. But apparently, the exceptions don't apply, or sorry, the exception to the rule applies if it's the Muslim migrants or their far leftist allies. Yeah, like I said, this is the kind of behavior I can expect from the Ishmaelite Muslim migrants as described in Genesis 16 verse 11 to 12, but this is also the kind of behavior that is increasingly being, that can increasingly be expected of their far leftist allies. I'll just put it that way. Again, just kind of on the spot, bit of a rant type video, but wanted to just get that out there to show, you know, uh, the kind of insanity going on over in France from these Muslim migrants and their far left wing allies. So anyway, we wanted to point that out. Don't be deceived by Islam and don't be deceived by social liberalism. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.